Next stop, it's all aboard for miniature train enthusiasts. These guys have a passion for mini railroads because it combines creativity and mechanics. Plus, it takes them back in time. Because we all know, big boys love toys too. It's kind of like, you know, the little boy dream. Having all the, you know, the trains and all, all the stuff to look at. You know, there's sound and there's all kinds of stuff. I don't know if you've had a chance to, to yes. have them run trains on the layout with the sound. Yes. I mean, it's, it's pretty cool. So this is your, this room is your whole... As my wife told her niece, she said, this is an old man's cave here. <laughs> <laughs> so this is where everything goes together. Right. And this takes a lot of time and patience. Okay, this is Linda, Terry's patient wife, who, <laughs> who supports his habit. Well, we have an agreement. Yes. Uh, she's, well, you see, she's got jewelry. She says I have no taste of jewelry, so I, I tell her, <laughs> if you want to buy it, go buy it. If I want to buy something to drink, look the other one. Why did you name Timmy Creek? Well, uh, we've got, had another bulldog that has since passed on. Her name was Tempe. And, uh, I hate to say this on the air, but uh, the dog could uh, urinate a river, and that's the reason why we named it Tempe Green. <laughs> <laughs> that's hysterical. My favorite part is, is watching everything work together. So I'm, I'm a scene guy. So, uh, you know, we made changes to our layout, so we had a steel mill at one time. So what I did is I put a you had the steel workers out there, and I made a little strike while the steel mill was still out oh, there. Oh, yeah. The Godzilla with the, the cars. Yes. Yeah, that's... So do you talk to the little guys? I do not. Okay. <laughs> I think Because they don't talk back. <laughs> Come visit me at flythecoop.tv or flythecoop on Facebook.